So today, we're just on a bit of a day hike. Uh, we're in Braithwaite. We're gonna do the coal head horseshoe, um, or loosely, that anyway. It just depends how we get on. Um, I'm with Hannah today, my better half, and Maggie. So I'll show you our route. And we're gonna make our way up to Grasdale Park. Um, and then it goes off this page, but we're gonna be coming back around this way. So we're just setting off. This is Miss Coldale Beck. So if you haven't watched the last video, uh, please check it out. I'll put a link in this corner. I've been going about half a mile now. You can just see Bassenthwaite Lake. Started to get some views. Walking up. And we're going up there. So just looking back, we've just come down this footpath and just see Derwent Water in the back. This will be Keswick. Just before five to two. So you can just see Crag Hill at the back, which is where we'll be later. Sail, outer side. Causey Park in the background. Is it all the way up there? Yep. Watch this. Oh, just at the top, Grasdale Park. Not with Megs. And just see the sea. Just for some context, Hope Head Gill, Hope Gill Head, sorry, is just round there. This is OL4. So we've just been Grasdale Park, and this is the footpath that we've come on. We just had dinner in shelter, and we're probably about here now. Um, and we've just got to come round. So this you can see at 739. Is this here? So we're just in the bottom, back up to the 739, and then round to Hawk Gill Head. We're at the top of Hawk Gill Head. It is quarter to four. The views up here are absolutely stunning. So yeah, this is Grasdale Park. And this is where we're going next. Looks like there's some And you can just see the end of Crummock Water, just at the bottom. So this is where we are, and this is the footpath we'll be taking over Sand Hill, and over to Crag Hill. So the actual route is up there for coal. The Coldale Horseshoe route, according to 
websites and things, but we're just gonna walk, follow this little stream and then come at it from the other side. Cause uh, yeah, not too keen on the look of that today. So we're just on his way up the back of Crag Hill. I don't know if you can see, but it is snowing. So we're just going up there. So there it is, top of Crag Hill, five past five. Who's been a good girl? Who's been a good girl? What's this? So we've been up Grasdale Park, down over to Hope Gill Head, and then we've been down the back of here and up to, to Crack Hill. So then we're making our way down, down this way. So we were just saying when you get to the bottom of here, um, if you had a little bit more time, you could go and do Causey Park, which is that there, but we're gonna come down and do out to side. Style end. That's where we've just come from, the scar. You can just see snow on the top, so I'm not sure what it is, but you can just see scar fell in the back. I think it's that one. I might be wrong. So here we are at the top of sail at 27 minutes past five. We've just done Crag Hill and the Scar and Sail. This was a zigzaggy path to here and we're just on his way down what's called Sheepfold on the map towards Outer Side and Style End. And this is the path. We're just on our way up out the side. And you can see from this angle really well as to where we've been. So we started going up to Grasdale Park up there. And we've come along Hope Gillhead down the back Crag Hill. Again, just the other side, this is sail. And then we've come down, my finger's in the wrong place, and the finger's come down this path and run his way up. We're at the top of outer side. It is quarter past six. See Derwent water down there. Some snow on the tops. Looks beautiful over there, the sun's out. Blue skies over Bass and Thwaite Lake. So yeah, top of outer side, I'm gonna go down to Style End. Just on the final uh, stretch up to Style End. See Skidor in the distance. There's outer side where we've just been and Causey Park. Yeah, so yeah. 10 to seven, not a bad view. Top of Style End. Where's the sun just setting? So now we've just got to make his way down back to the car. Thank you for watching today. Um, yeah, this has been the Coaldale Horseshoe. Uh, I definitely recommend the walk for anybody. Um, it's not enormously difficult. Um, it's taken us about seven hours, something like that. Um, six and a half, seven hours. Uh, we've not been rushing around. It might take somebody eight hours, it might take somebody five um, or a little bit less. If you've got any comments or any questions that you want to ask me, please do put them um, below. And if you've liked the video, please do give me a thumbs up um, and subscribe for more. Oh, here we are, back at the car. Um, total distance today, according to Strava anyway, just under seven hours. It's 10 miles, 26.